Well, as the weather gets warmer outside, more people are firing up their grills. And if you're looking for a delicious side to go with your next meal, you're in luck. Joining us this morning is Scott Thomas, the owner of Hotel Hickman Chuck Wagon Barbecue, to share his tasty recipe for coleslaw and beans. Thanks for coming in this Good morning. Good morning. How are you today? I'm great. I'm digging the hat. Well, thank you. Looking great. So let's start off with this, the, the Chuck Wagon Cook, because that's what you say you are. Yes. What is that? Well, we have an 1889 Chuck Wagon, so we do all of our cooking over open fires in cast iron. Oh, so nice. people say, are you a chef? No, a chef is a, <laughs> is a trained professional. We're just chuck wagon cooks. Oh, look at that. We were showing off some pictures of you there in action. All right, so let's start off with, with these beans. So what are you doing here? Okay, we soak some northern white beans. Uh, we're going to add uh, two tablespoons of our Hotel Hickman seasoning, mm -hmm. two and a half cups of sweet onions, two and a half cups of sweet peppers, uh, half a cup of brown sugar, Oh, get, gotta get some sweetness in there, right? And a cup and a half of molasses. Oh, there's the good stuff too. And, and what are some of the seasonings that you've got in, in, in your blend? It's top secret. Top secret, top you can't even secret. give us like one? Whiskey, whiskey <laughs> powder is in it. Whiskey powder, yeah. ooh, see that's a good one. That's and then a good we're secret. gonna add uh, four cups of your favorite barbecue sauce. Today we're using Hotel Hickman's cherry barbecue sauce. Oh, wow. And then you're gonna just let that simmer for about an hour or two. And then stir once, that all up and you get, you get this. That, and then they turn out looking like this. Oh my goodness. All right. I, I, I have to taste this. And what, what do you love about this? This the recipe? Most? Yeah. Well, this is one, it used to be one of our secret recipes till today. So now everybody knows it. But, um, you know, just making them mm. from scratch. Um, it's oh just a good, goodness. tasty. A lot of levels of flavor, too. I oh, mean, and I even forgot. With that sweetness. I forgot a little bit of pork in the beans. Oh. There's that too. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. Just a little added something. All right, so also coleslaw. Yes, ma'am. Okay, so, so I'm going to so, help you out here. Okay, so uh, we're going to add our seasoning. We have uh, celery seed. Okay. You can dump that right in. All right. Salt. Salt, all of this. Garlic pepper. Okay. Half That's a cup of sugar. Out. All righty. Half a cup of sugar. And then we're going to uh, add one cup of vegetable oil and a cup and three quarter of apple cider vinegar. All right. And then you just mix that up, let it marinate for a while. Okay. And then you've got the, uh, the finished product there as well, huh? Yes. So okay. this, we can, we can help yourself. Thank you so much. Get some of this. And tell us about, as, as, I, as I sample yet another dish that he's brought, <laughs> tell, us, tell us what else we can find at your place. I know you brought some of the, some of the meats here as well. Well, we have our uh, Texas style beef brisket, our jalapeno cheddar cheese smoked sausage, and some ribs I brought today for you folks to try out. Wonderful. I know everyone's excited. As soon as they saw all your stuff, it's like everyone starts, starts salivating. Did you want some beans? I did taste the beans, okay. and I'll get those in just a minute. I'll have some more of those. Alrighty. And so what is it about kind of grilling season? What would your advice be to people who are, you know, getting ready to, to enjoy this warmer weather and, and get outside? Well, with us, it's uh, cooking it low and slow. You know, with our meats, we smoke them uh, for about 14 hours for our brisket, uh, six hours for our ribs, and then with the beans, just cooking them slow. So. It's not a real fast process, but yeah. um, it turns out really good. Yeah, Just you take your time and enjoy end. it. Exactly. Yes. And we want to make sure everyone knows where you guys are located. Uh, we are downtown Dexter mm -hmm. and we're in Hamburg Township. Okay, wonderful. Thank you so much. Well, you're welcome. Chuck Wagon Cook. Chuck Wagon Cook, yes ma'am. I love it. Thank you. Thank Everything you. tastes delicious. Well, thank and you. And we'll have a link to the recipes on our website, WXYZ.com. Just check the scene on 7 section. Hallie, there is plenty here. <laughs> I you just want to like it. dive into one of these things. Yes, it is always <laughs> so, so good. So thank you for leaving some behind. But